By now, you probably know that most of the Mardi Gras celebrations have been canceled due to COVID-19. But in Baldwin County, there may still be hope for a parade. Debbie Williams has that story. For decades, Mardi Gras crews have paraded throughout communities in Baldwin County. But this year, one little community may be Mardi Gras's last hope. The sounds and spectacle of Mardi Gras will be missing in most places this year, but all may not be lost. You know, as long as they give us permission, we're, we're going to go with it. Gail Pierce got Mardi Gras rolling in Fort Morgan two years ago. Golf carts, cars, jeeps, boats. Um, some people have taken the trailers and decorated them. All parading down a two-mile stretch of Ponce de Leon. This year, a request has been made to the Baldwin County Commission to grant permission for the parade again this year, February 14th. If that happens, it will be more than just a Mardi Gras parade for folks who call Fort Morgan home and are still recovering from a record-breaking hurricane season. It's everybody needs a boost. Everybody's tired of hearing hammers and saws all day long and just to see what we've, the community has been through because it's, it's been tough. For a community with only 500 full-time residents, Pierce says a socially distant Mardi Gras shouldn't be that difficult. You can go along a block of the parade route and not see anybody. And she's hopeful commissioners will give it the gold, purple, and green light of approval. It's just something to do and lift everybody's spirits and get excited about Mardi Gras. A decision on whether or not the good times will roll in Fort Morgan this year? expected next week. On the Baldwin County Beat, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.